Hello. I think I'm good. I think I got everything good to go. Let me know if audio issues are here or not. Oh, that's not good. There we go. Now it should be good. Poyato. Yes, the Poyato. Poyato. My chair picking up. My chair is picking up. Made an audio filter on that. First time setups. Oh, the bed is on there. Whoops. Oh well. All good. I have only played the tutorial so far. Um, I can start again if you want to guys want to see the start. Otherwise, I, I'm cool with just picking up where I was. Oh yes, I am a strange streamer you've never seen before. Definitely not someone I usually see on Mondays. Absolutely not. Is the audio good? Yes, no, maybe so. I know Wally's having a probably tough time even watching this right now. Mm, there's one last thing I need to do. No music from the game, if there is some. It's probably very quiet then. Um, how can I do this? This is maxed out on my end. I'll just have to blow out my ears, I think. Um, bop, bop, bop. Can you hear the music now? It's very quiet music. The music is very quiet, yeah. <laughs> Definitely not. This is my first time meeting all of you. I don't know what you're talking about. Except for Gene. I'm in his translator. You hear it? Okay. Um, one last thing I need to do then. And then I'll get started. Who am I? I... Ooh, good question. Most people call me Potato. But some people can call me Poma. Yeah. Let me go ahead and at the spuds. There we go. There we go. Okay. So the audio is good. Um, now the question is, do I start again? Just do the restart the tutorial, or do I just pick up with the first mission? <laughs> I haven't done a stream like this in a while. First mission, okay. I colored my mech. That's all I've done. So I'm going to figure out what I'm doing from there. Um, it probably is good to do this. Huh? Standardized training parts. Use this for instruction. Hmm. I'll just buy my equipment. Yeah. That's just a tutorial mission. We'll do this. Um, pop up defang or defend defang defang MT squads deployed in grid one three five. All right. Got 
my job for you, 621. It's an open call from the Archivist Group, one of the extraplanetary corporate forces. To all independent mercenaries, this request comes from Schneider of the Archivist Group. That sounds like a nerd. The operation will take place in Grid 135, Southern Velius. Your objective is to destroy an MT squad sent by Dafung, a Balaam company, and a competitor. Grid 135 is a key foothold in Archivist's efforts to conduct a coral survey in the contaminated city. You, the independent mercenaries, are the key to maintaining our lead in the coral survey race. Yeah, I get you, Wally. I'll see you. Forward to news of your success. Or whenever you head out, I'll see you. Appreciate it. I uh, can't really do anything, so I'll just go. You've got ID. Now you need a rep. Get their attention, six two one. Okay, now I have to remember the controls again. It's been a week. Oh wait, I've been here. Saying this is the gist of the game, just float around, pop bots. Imagine things don't get exciting until later. There we go. Commander who? Credits. One new message. Woo, money. This is a notification from All Might, the mercenary support system. Registration number RB23. Call sign Raven. Your return to mercenary activities has been acknowledged. Restoring access to the parts shop. Yes. First thing I'm buying a pistol. <laughs> That's all I can afford. Probably. Uh. 
Uh, more parts available to purchase as progress through the story or meet certain conditions. Okay. That's the big old pistol. Um... So, my left arm already has a sword on it. And there's a sword that does a lot of damage, but I have to, like, get real nice, close, and personal. Um, I think I already have... Yeah, I already have that missile launcher. I don't know if I need another one. Pulse shield. Okay, that's what I got currently. That's what I can buy for the other side. Pistol dual missile launcher developed by blah blah blah. Traps targets in the pincer trajectory, limiting invasive options. Full well, is suitable for use with lightweight builds and is capable of multi lock. Um, well, this sounds most useful, to be honest. I already have three weapons. I don't know if I need a fourth right now. Ooh, heads, okay. Oh, there's a lot more. Okay. I uh, can't afford any new cores. I can afford to arm uh, these arms. They have to get along. Can get two. Okay. Um, I think I have an idea what I'm going for. Just because of like what I normally do in shooters, but we'll see. Maybe I'll like something different. I know there's the uh, wheelchair build, which is just tank treads and chain guns. Which I'm not going to do, because it seems very easy for my skin to do that. <laughs> don't really care for lightweight. I kind of like, like to say middle build, because lightweight I'll get myself killed pretty easily. Yeah, like these kind of legs, I don't... Nah. Um... This is kind of heavier. Heavyweight, yeah. Ooh, what's that? Uh, true missile specialist. This is my this is my missile lock on her. Uh, uh, lock on capabilities, I guess. Okay, generator. Do, 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 do. Lightweight construction matched with excellent EN recharge capabilities. Very low ca uh, capacity, a lot of recharge. It said lightweight, but it's heavy as hell. Alright, well, um. Large caliber handgun developed by Bum. Alright, Theory introduced blah, blah, blah. strong stopping power, tremendous impact potential. And impact total rounds low. What's the capacity? That's the AC fix. Uh, to, oh, well, that's how many rounds. I wanted to see how much was actually in the mag before reloading. Hmm. A lot less bullets, though. It means I'd be running out. A lot faster. I think there's like a kick you can do with certain legs. I haven't seen people do that. tree, slender branches, philosophy, their weight is balanced, but by heavier upper legs and lighter... I'm probably gonna go with these when I get money. How did I miss this? <laughs> Booster. That's better most of the way around. Medium weight builds, including... Okay. Uh, well, we're kind of aiming for that, so let's go with that. There we go. Heck yeah. Um, this one is better for mid and long range than what I currently have. Not very good at close range, but I'm only using it for mostly sticking to further distances anyways, and now I'm broke. <laughs> mm. 
AC design assembly. Okay, I didn't get a new gun. I did get a new booster. That's good. Um, and then this thing. Yeah, alright. Better inner components. Alright. Um, part shop. Not part shop. Sortie. Missions. Let's do this one. Man, I can remember any of these company names. So go in, slaughter everything. Got it. Don't have much to change. Let's go. Let's go. The client doesn't care who does this job. As long as it gets done. Set that to wait. There we go. All right. Right. Whoops. I'm gonna have to switch that. That sort of hits hard. Messed up. I don't remember what the button is to heal. B? B. We'll see. There we go. Anything? Mm 
There we go. Can I like just grab one of these ACs, rip off their gun, and use it? I'd like to do that. I'm already used half my ammo. Alright, well. That ain't awesome. Any more? Clear out the artillery here and our work is over. There's some. Well, I got a lot of pride. I don't know what's going on though. Anymore before I tuck this one out? No? Okay. Confirmed. All targets destroyed. That's it for this job, 621. Return to base. Hope I get a good bonus. Yeah, I got a good bonus. Holy. That's what I'm talking about. Fun. Uh, what? You've been invited to join the log hunt. What is log hunt? Okay. It says right there, but like, what? Why? <laughs> okay. Uh, give me... Sword hits hard... Potato dead emote? I do need to get a potato dead emote, you're right. Uh, arms load limit, firearm specialization, weight, and a lot, a lot more weight on that. I'm trying to look at his legs, though. I need more money for those legs, though. Okay, see you in a bit, Apathy. I'm just learning. Bazooka. Um, why is it not available on the other gun? Or other end? Okay, give me the handgun. I just want to try it out and see how that goes. And then the shield generator should be good. 
So I guess you design assembly. Uh, give me the pistol. I could switch the hands on my wood, but oh well. Do the shield generator, that'll be nice. Expansion. Uh, did I grab the pistol? I did, yes. I got the shield generator again. Making sure. Alright, um, I think I'm good. Sorty. Missions. Extra reward based on number of enemies destroyed. Yes, please. Got a job for you, six two one. The Balaam Group sent a request. Raven, this request comes from Dafa, one of our affiliates. Fuck off, Omega. <laughs> That sounds like he's got a lot of ego. Uh, I got a pistol and a sword and a shield generator and rockets. Should be fine. Should probably use my rockets. I haven't been using them. That does okay. Should probably look at it from the screen. There we go. System activating combat mode. Okay. Destroy the Rubicon Liberation Force. Oh, just right there. Oh, okay. Ah, uh, that was good. Big caliber pistol. Just wait for my sword again, because this ain't gonna do nothing. Okay, so how much does this let me down? Not much, okay. Here you go. Bop. Corporation. Confirmed. Target destroyed. On to the next targets. Oh my god, if I should just top over to the VC, just let me know. If it'd be easier to do it that way.
Oh. Oh. I'm not making much of a dent in this dude. Uh, probably should use rockets. Not any about it. Yeah, that would make sense. No repair kits remaining. Yeah, I know. Right hand ammunition at fifty percent. Ow, dude. I mean I can mention Would you stop with the sweet potatoes? I, I see that. The rockets ain't make much of a dent either. this setup so on a checkpoint bro just gotta go about it a bit differently Oops. How do I do the kick thing? I didn't learn that. Or is that only certain legs, maybe? So, for the buckler? What's the, the buckler? focus on the mission. Okay, so he doesn't want me to kill that thing. He just wants me to try to evade it. Of course, I can do some damage to it. I just need to hit it when it goes in for its sword attack. Oh, I didn't time that right. Remaining. 
Whoopsie. That wasn't great. Come on. I got you. Oh, I see what you're saying. Okay. Yeah, I don't have anything really yet, because I didn't do the training stuff. <laughs> I'll just use rockets for that. Oh, or not. Huge mistake not doing the training. Okay, I could probably go back and do it. I just thought it would have been not entertaining to watch, so I just didn't do it. Looks like you got them all. That's it for this job, 621. Return to base. I gotta handle this taking care of that target though. Big boy. You yeah. air costs. Yeesh. Okay. Uh I should keep that in mind. I don't know who I will even want to side with because I don't know anything about these politics. All right. Um, I have some cash now. I don't have enough for the legs I want to buy, though. I don't think. Yeah, no. I want to get I want to get these legs. I think these are good legs. They're the most expensive legs, but I like the look of them, so. But anyways, I'll go do the training. Basic controls. Maybe you'll teach me how to kick. Lock on. Yep. Older up fire. Yep. Oh, I see. Okay. I want to keep track of where I'm actually looking. Reloading? Oh, I can manually reload. Okay. Good to know. Uh, I didn't know about multi-lock. During multi-lock. Cancel multi-lock. Okay. Yeah, I didn't do the chain attack. How do I know what I can do with chain attack? Or did I test it before I get to the target? Fires risky close range approach, but have high damage power impact and are useful for destroying the shields. Okay, there's that way of doing things. Then when I go for this approach, can I still do... No, I cannot. Okay, a charging one I cannot double up. I have to be close beforehand. Which means I can use the boosters to do that and go bam, pow. Okay. I did do that on accident.
then. So scan control money clutch. Okay. That's what that uh second what kind I was using was. Okay. Ba -ba -ba, training. Combat fundamentals. Okay. It's gonna teach me about staggers and stuff, I think. Uh, ch charge attacks. Hold right hand charge attack. I already canceled the charge attack. Okay. Kind of like that. That's a fun weapon. Uh, the ACS attitude can have to. Yeah, yeah, attitude control system of the craft can be compromised by accumulating strain from the impact of repeated attacks. ACS overload results in vulnerable state called the stagger, which dur uh, during which time the afflicted craft will be immobilized and susceptible to critical damage. Hold, okay. Which is why you want to use the sword. Okay. Direct hits. During stagger, all incoming attacks are treated as direct hits and deal more damage. So you really want to line up those before you go for the kill, got it? Cumulative the strain. Right. Yeah, okay. You know, uh, it's varying amount of the cumulative strain. Okay. That's a shield. Yep, I did figure that out on my own. Attacking their initial guard. Next by is one to two seconds after deployment. Okay, so parrying, essentially. So after the boamp, boamp, that's when you want to hit it, okay. Learning. Assault boost attack. Uh, during assault boost rush, small arms that ought to be used during deployment with greater impact. Got it. Okay, that's what the auto lock is really useful for, is that. Got it? Linear rifle. Any more trainings, or is that all of it now? Looks like that's all of it. Okay. I see that by well, that was a mistake. It was because those are uh, good items to have, I imagine. Um, does not replace any of that, though. I do like the rifle. Uh, 
Hmm. So lacking firepower, use alone. Shines in double trigger builds. Whatever, okay. Senator Assault Rifle, developed by Bomb, balances fire performance and firepower, making it easy to use on full auto, uh, long selling class popular with anyone from a new corporate recruits to veteran mercenaries. Alright. Pack power is less than the pistol. Well, that's probably without the charge, I imagine. And it's got um, more ammo. So, we'll go with that. It is heavier, though. But not, like, a crazy amount bad. I don't have anything else to really put on. So that's all we have. Okay. Alright. Um, I have some cash, but I want to get those legs. Gotta get them legs, man. New items. Yeah, there's that stuff. Okay, I got them. They give me those weapons as secondary options, got. How do these. How does changing helps up? Heads help. Defense's performance at a tiered stability. Overall AP. Okay. Weight is also a big factor. That's a heavy head. Why is this one so light but it looks the biggest? Or am I reading it wrong? So it's flat. Okay. Um, what should I be buying right now, Omega? Or is it did not really matter? Generator. If you're still there anyways. Oops. That just closed everything. Hmm. Well, I'll leave it alone for now. Mission. Destroy Tester AC. You got a job for you, 621. It's an open call from the Archivist Group. To all independent mercenaries, this request comes from Schneider of the Archivist Group. Dafung, one of our adversaries allied with Balaam, has introduced a new tester AC. It's a sample model from an external architect, featuring extensive assembly optimizations. In the hands of an experienced pilot, it will pose a threat far too great to ignore. This brings me to the request. Intercept delivery of the tester AC, and destroy it. The Archivist Group looks forward to news of your success. Briefing over. Happy hunting. Permissions. Add everyone. Speak video. Use voice activity. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. There we go. Okay. Yeah, it forced my own settings, you poor <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. You need to use your missiles. Uh, a lot, I so assume. Either to force enemy movement or hit multiple enemies by holding it. Okay. Uh, well, let me do one thing real quick. Copy that. Move that here. You just want to use your normal PFP for Fugi? That's your choice. Or do you want to give me an image so I can use for you? I mean, I'm just here to just tell you a few things, and then I'm going to probably go back to Swift. Oh, okay. Unless you need help. Um, you are the lore master in my head or my mind. Well, I mean, AC six doesn't 
connect to a lot of the older armored cores, so. Oh, well, I mean, you did play this game, though, right? You, like, beat it? Yes. Yeah. Uh. Oop, not me. Control Z that, Control Z that. Then. Oh, should also decide ahead of time. Yeah, you got time. What? Choose between whether heavy, light, or medium. AC or something in between. Transition. There we go. Um, I'm thinking medium with some light parts. Is that even a thing? Yeah. Okay. Because I like timing weapons. And... Well, I'll tell you now, the orbiter chest plate you're using is probably... Want me need to change it out for little chapters away. Want me to change for a while? Okay. Other parts, like the arms and legs, you might. But... And do the arena stuff. Do arena? Is that the PvP? Yes, you get... You, not actual PvP. Oh. Uh, go to... While well, you're already in a mission thing. Uh, I can go back. Go back? Yeah. I don't think I have it yet. Well, no, just go back a minute to the... Oh, it's delayed on the stream. It'll show up. Oh, yeah. Uh, the tra not training, but... Oh, you may not have it unlocked yet. Yeah, I don't think I have it unlocked yet. Yeah, yeah. when your arena lock rank's unlocked, it's just mostly... What do you call it? Uh, AIs you'll be fighting, but... Oh, okay. I was, I was able to beat that tanky bastard easy. without even any little help yet, so... Stay sharp, well, another thing is take more better advantage of the uh, uh, when he breaks his bar. I can't remember what it's called when he gets stunned. Yeah, the, uh, yeah. Um, it was in the training, the stagger. Main system activating yeah. combat uh, mode. And again, start using your missiles. They're really useful. Mm -hmm. Okay, I just I feel like I will run out quick, but I guess I have more than I thought. Okay. If you hold it, I'm sure you already saw things, but hold it and move between multiple enemies and then it'll lock on to. That pilot's just a trainee on delivery duty. Don't let your guard down. That'd be good. As you can see, it goes down very fast. Ooh. Wait for him to land or stop a boost move before you release your uh, gun. Okay. So make sure you get hit on him. There's a hit, okay. I remember I can tap this weapon too. Ow. Got him. Kid, I almost got my shit wiped by you. <laughs> Enemy AC destroyed. It'll come with time. That's it for this job. You just remember how movements work. Yeah, that's like a good good tip on the wing on boosting. Yeah. But like I said, use missiles more. And... Also, I probably should have done auto lock since it was a one on one. There are certain missiles that are better for fighting an AC or highly mobile opponent, but that's later. Gotcha. I have a chip that's good for 
We're better for longer range stuff, from my understanding. Uh, you'll want to go for medium, for longer range. Yeah. So it's not specifically for missiles. There's a specific uh, stat for that. Okay. It's more better for uh, the one or two, I think, sniper rifles. Or long range laser rifles. There we go. Okay. Um. <clears throat> yeah, I gotta. I'll have to switch out chips then, because this is definitely a long range chip. Yeah, because you're mostly close range, so. Yep. Uh, let me see when it catches up. Well, well, well. Handler Walker. The way your hound's been up in my business, I'm surprised you'd even dare to call. I just can't wait for us to do the co-op mod so I can evade you. <laughs> Is it out yet or no? Yeah, sure technically out. Yeah. It's, it's more of a co-op <laughs> right now. Oh, okay. Not that they're invading us. People in a mat in a mission. Dang. Wow. All right. And you got a deal. I'll send Volt and Aguasu. They'll give your latest hound a proper so red gun welcome. I'd rather you wait until you at least beat the game once. There's three storylines. I know somewhat about the storyline stuff. I watched somebody play this game a little bit. That's yeah. why I know a little bit. So, but... one new the match. first one, you'll probably be forced into the lowest Six, one. one. You about could get lucky and you get into that was being shipped to the, red guns. the second Balaam's one, which is normally New Game Plus. Squad. But you have to beat the game three times to get the true ending. Remember who you're messing with. Or just secret ending, whichever one you want to call it. Right. I call it true ending. Well, requires the most money effort. Yeah. Alright, so I've been. You actually can't do the missions for it till. I've been eyeballing these legs. Are these good legs or bad legs? Uh, let me see the legs. I'll show up eventually on the stream. Second. The Tian Tang? Yeah, uh, Tian King, yeah. Mm hmm. Oh, Tian King. Um, press F, I think it is. Whichever one is. Yeah, toggle display. I just like to look so, at them, but. I mean, most legs are gonna kind of be better, but you're also going to lose a lot of boost speed. A lot of boost speed, okay. But, you the, the, well, the thing is, the orbiter legs are not the best legs, so. The real problem is how much weight you're going to gain. Um, looks e like... So, e load is e honestly one of the worst. e load is worse on these legs than the orbiter legs, but only yeah. by a smidgen, according to the bar. Yeah. And weight is well, a good bit worse on um, these ones. can go get filled within minutes, depending on if you put an energy weapon or something that takes more energy. Yeah. They're not... Bad legs, but you're gonna lose supply efficiency. Uh, if you stick with heavy weapon, not heavy weaponry, uh, ballistic weaponry, you should be fine if you really want those legs that bad. It's not like a must, I just like the look of them. No. I mean, the best thing about Armor Core is you can, in fact, go, uh, go loot, uh, core. Not loot core, uh, fashion core, but. It will be harder for you. Yeah. Because, because like, I don't, I don't really like these skinny, like skinny ass legs. Although I know they'd be better for close range stuff. Well, the really light legs, you're gonna have to lose some weight on the rest of your body too, but they'll make you the fastest. Yeah. Meanwhile, by uh, beetle. Melander is a pretty good upgrade. It's almost the. I guess for Elden Ring uh, references, it'd be like getting that first knight armor. Oh, yeah. You know? Okay. Upgrade from what the fuck you start with, or you usually start with. And then there's also these guys, but those, I don't really like the look of these guys either. But you don't have to focus on one of these right now. As, as you do missions, you're going to get more stuff unlocked in the part shop. Right. Um, how vital do you think it is to have the sword? Um, 
honestly, the sword's good, or it's great even, just because it's a, a heavily damaging weapon that never runs out of ammo. Right. <clears throat> okay. Um, little missile entries. Yeah, how, do you really want the buckler? I mean, if you get good at buckling, it's not bad. Yeah, I'm, I'm forgetting I'm having it, is the problem, so. Then you might want to switch it for... Should I do the same one I have currently, or these so, little missile launchers? That's regular missile launchers, so there's a couple of different variations. It's whether you're forward launching, upwards launching. Forward's good if you're getting up in their face a lot and you're really close, because... You know, it's just shortest distance. So these ones are better for airborne targets at a distance. Well, the ones you have on the right are upwards firing. Okay, so these are direct then? No, those are also upward firing. Oh, so, okay. Well, actually, those are kind of direct. If you hit R when you go to them, you know, uh, you how they shoot. Oh, it's like, or okay, I see, yeah. yeah. So those ones are best for enemies that will try to boost around to dodge to force them to dodge oh that that means it'd be good to be using with the the linear rifle i got or whatever it's called yeah because that means i can get more guaranteed shots in um then i'll have both and just to be more versatile remember, i think yeah that's fun do you yeah. remember the missiles he was using uh yeah they were really slow but they constantly harass you, didn't they? Yeah. And they were the thing. That's another way they can go. Scary night marker. Of course, there's plasma uh, missiles. Uh, what's the buckler? So wait, what's my overall AC stats? Press that oh, right now. There we go. Uh, okay. A lot of numbers. Okay, so... Okay, these marks are my limit size, looks like, uh, at the bottom here. The bottom, yes. That's your current load, your current arms load. So, arms load will mainly be, obviously, the weapons in your hand. Yeah. But that can also contribute to your current load, because how heavy it can be. Yeah. I think because I have the sword in my left hand, I think it is. Um, it's not too much of an issue having this long-ass rifle, my other. Of course, you could also, uh, I'm not sure if you noticed, but on your back unit, you can put weapons like the pistol or that gun there and switch them out. It would take away one of your tools, but some people do that on the left arm so they can switch between them. That's usually for faster... Astromex with uh, dual submachine pistols or something like that. Okay. Hmm. Just uh, they'll AC uh, stagger you and then they'll switch over and start beating you up. Gotcha. Hmm. I need credits more than anything. Um, you can. It's a little trick, but you can literally keep doing the same missions you've already done by mission replay. And you do get that money. I could do the the kid one. Because yeah. it's pretty yeah. quick if I'm actually better, get better at it, yeah. Another thing to watch for is you see how it says AC log? Or oh, log? I did, yeah. Sometimes you can miss those, so it's always good to look back and see if you've got some of the battle logs or. <clears throat> so you haven't unlocked the hunting logs yet either? Yeah. It's nice how we're playing missions give you credit still. Yep. Okay. So, big difference about last time we'll make is actually auto locking so I can keep my vision on him. Yeah. Uh, also, you do get the full amount back from selling parts that you did for Okay, so I can trade out shit. Yeah, it goes 
down the stagger meter. I'm gonna keep the pressure on if you start that. Okay. I went a lot better that time. Yep. That's what I mean. You should, you're still learning. You're gonna keep. I need to make use of my vertical efforts more though, because I was getting racked up on the actual well, small tick damage. Also, don't forget that when you're in air, you are a little bit easier to hit than when you're on the ground and moving. Okay, so I would have actually gotten more tick damage if I wasn't there more. Yep, they could have. It always depends on both their weapons. Oh. But yeah, you make money that way. Well, it's until later on, you're not going to make a huge amount. Yeah. But fighting boss gets you more money. I don't think the first thing gets you a lot. Probably not. Fight him. Uh, maybe? I don't know. I think I actually can. I'm thinking about it. I'd have to replay that one a lot right. just for those legs, though. So I'll probably just keep going with the other missions. Yeah, just go on. What you really want to do is unlock the uh, training. Or I say training, the arena. Okay. The AI bot. Yeah. Because that gives you all kinds of weapons and. So, like. I think I just okay, do the lower so ones first. This is a escort. It, it kind of. Kind of okay. I can't, the one I do usually lets me make a choice in the middle of the battle, but I don't think because you're a first-time player you have that. I can't remember. I don't think so. Right. But uh, yeah. But all right, I'll see you. Yep. Uh, I'm gonna see you. Go back and also go to the bathroom. Alright, well, you can hop back in the VC whenever you want. Got a job All right. six, two, one. Yeah, hopefully this time I'm not going to be forced to push the talk. You won't. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you. See ya. Heard the good news from Walter, did ya? Good. Sit your ass down and listen. Balaam's moving in on the Galleon Dam complex. One of the Liberation Front's bases. Boop, 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 boop. Okay, done that. Let me get. I'm just setting some settings differently in the VC chat, just so I can let some people just join on their own volition. Um, anyone else will have to just ask me to drag them in. Wah. There, I can just connect automatically now, and that's good to go. I think. All right. Wow. Oh, shoot stuff. Shoot stuff real good. I'll stick with 621. Don't let the red guns teach you bad manners. I got this lemonade Mountain Dew. I don't know how it's going to taste. Here we go. Doesn't taste like lemonade. Balaam Group AC Squad Red Guns reporting for duty. Commence mission. Attack! Get in there, you maggots! Great. An independent merge. It's the wise guy who decided the Red Guns should be taking care of some freelance. We'll handle this mission ourselves. One target destroyed. 
You guys can do anything. I swear I'm killing everything here. And we've killed like maybe a few small dudes. That's about it. Jeez, bazooka much, huh? Chase has been. Dude, dude, worse than the frickin' uh, kid. There'll be a bot here. What? More ants. There's so many ants. What? I wasn't even in this. Hold on. Mandatory. Thank you. Here we go. I don't know. I don't know. Catching up on things. Ziggy's recruiting more people. Like the fox do. There we go. <clears throat> okay. Got some money. So I don't have that. Okay. One new message. All mine again. Nope, okay. You got lucky, Merc. You were the only warm body they could find. The red guns are going to be first over the wall. Have fun watching from the sidelines. Oh boy. I'm definitely going to use that. Absolutely. Um, ooh, I almost have enough of them legs, don't I? Give me them special legs. Ooh, I have enough. Yeah! Okay. The weight is worse. Overall. Um, my current even load will be bad. Okay. 
Ooh. In case. Oh, wait, no, it's not. That's my limit. My end's fine. In fact, it makes my current load a lot better. Holy load limit would be nice. My speed will drop by a little bit. That's not too bad. Boost speed is reduced a good bit, too. Should be fine. I'm, like, broke now, but I got the uh, chunky, chunky legs. Yeah, baby. Like that. All right, I'm going to change the head next, because he said the order of body is pretty good for a long while, and I'll change the arms after that. That's for gun. I'm liking the gun I got. Let's do this. Got a job for you, 621. This one's a request from the archivist group. Raven, this request comes from Schneider. What are those? What are what? The legs? You just jumped into the call just for that. <laughs> being blocked by the Strider, a Rubicon Liberation Front mining ship. You are to destroy it. The Strider is a mobile resource base that was extensively weaponized by the Liberation Front. Call it the crowning glory of their efforts to militarize into an anti-corporate force. Your attack will focus on the eye giant laser cannon connected directly to the main generator. It's protected by a shield, which is powered by auxiliary sub-generators. These should be your first targets. This concludes the briefing. Good luck. I don't need luck, I got gun. You got gun, because I got gun. I also got these chunky ass legs. Boogie. I still try and get a handle on all these dang corporate names. I'll just go ahead and do some real quick. There we go. Hey. I was in first person there for a moment. Yeah, where where am I going? Scanning range is small. Oh, is it that thing? Okay. Uh, very close attention to your uh, meter when it gives you a warning. Which meter? I have tons. You'll see. It's your partner. You'll see. When it warns you, only jump then. Only jump then, okay. That okay. <laughs> yeah. Get used to that. That's gonna have to pop it. Picking up a surge of energy to the eye. Alright, good luck. Watch out. How do I evade this? Oh my god. AP at fifty percent. You'll jump to the left or right of it. You wanna face it when it turns to that. I wanna face it? Okay. You'll want to get as much lateral movement as possible. Yeah, not even that's gonna save you. You can't overboost that. You have to dodge. I have to dodge. I have to like time dodge it. Okay. Yeah. Face it so and time dodge. Warning. Holy. All right. All right. Good luck. Thank you.
Damn it. I'll boost the opposite direction of where I'm head going, I guess, maybe. Uh, that's right, I have to head toward, straight towards it. Okay. And I need to work on that. Oh, there we go, I invited it. Nope, too early. No more leg. Confirmed. Strider leg compromised. It's going down. Uh, I probably shouldn't be underneath it then. Huh. Well. Checkpoint. There we go. <laughs> Flip it and ship it. Fuck me. Couple of the rear, fuck you. I'm on. Oh, fuck me. Oh. Dude, your encouraging words aren't helping them actually stop me. And your eye is doing nothing. Where is that? Underneath? Ow. Uh, missiles. Right, missiles. I mean, I was able to deal with the gun, but sure, yeah, I could have used missiles. Yeah, it probably wasn't great to give by that. Oh, some bitch. I ran out of boosters getting back up here. <laughs> uh, 
Ah, uh, fuck. Give me that checkpoint. Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> Oh, hello. Ow, 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 ow. Stop it. Okay, I don't want to be close to when it does that either. Great, okay. Boosters and checkpoints. Confirmed. Target destroyed. Do I just jump ship? And it looks like all that energy it was sucking up has nowhere to go. Yeah. Move six to one. You need to get clear of the strider. You got it. Oh, wanted me to go that way. Fuck. Um. Hmm. That may be a problem. I'm gonna. I'm trying, sir. Oh my God! <laughs> Holy shit! God damn. Well, good couple embarrassing deaths there. Still not good at dodging an eye. You must be the handler, I presume, for the independent mercenary Raven. Honored to make your acquaintance, V2 Snail. I understand you want to join Operation Wall Climber. You do realize that disposing of some Liberation Front garbage hardly know your place, you bigger dog sitter. The answer is no. I hear you're deploying V1 again. Must be rough only having one good pilot to rely on. Oh, are you suggesting your dog can take Freud's place? You'll see. Just give us the chance. Oops. I just wanted to get that visualizing because apathy followed me two hours ago and I completely missed it. So they both perform. I need to get the stream elements working again for that. Crap. Okay, rap. One new message. Raven, your work on the Strider deserves commendation. I am thrilled to have issued you the request. Allow me to introduce myself. I am the Archivist Group's mercenary liaison. V8 Pater, at your service. Uh, okay. I think I'll enjoy doing business with you. All right. I ain't using these emblems, man. You can't make me. I like to know that, but that's good. What you got in shot? Shotgun. A laser rifle. This is what the EN stuff he was talking about, wasn't it? Energy load. Plasma rifle. Dude, these things are fucking sick. Mmm. Oh, 
to go on the offhand. Nice. Um, EN shortfall. Wow, that thing is nuts then, huh? Uh, that's what I currently got on. What's this guy got? Woo! Alright, uh, eight cell vertical missile launcher developed by Furlong. Alright. Uh, what's this one? Plasma missile launcher. Hi, Yorkers. Thank you. Uh, overheated plasma explosion helped to circumvent cover or similar defenses. This vertical trajectory of missile. Alright, wait, sorry, I can just go. There you go. No, that's not it. Uh, nope, that's not it either. Uh, uh, video, video. Uh, R, there we go. Uh, 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 oh, I see. Okay. I see, I see. You're playing Helldivers? Nice. Bringing democracy to the land. That doesn't really change much across the board. It does give me overall better everything, though, than the normal head, so. Um, medium weight. Is this lightweight or is this heavyweight? It's about the same. Um, hmm. I got some cash. We said the chest should be fine for a while. I don't have to worry that. This matches the legs, so I'll be overall looking nice. Uh, my ELEN EN load's getting rough there, though. Boost speed's even worse. So probably don't want to stack up commonly looking items. If it makes everything else blah, just garbage. Um, better defenses, better everything better across the board except for boost speed, which is only slightly down. Um, wait. It's quite a bit heavier. Ian loads worse as well. Look at generators. Pay attention to that firearm specialization on arms. Also, there is a melee specialization stat on arms. Okay. Where's the melee specialization? Is it on the toggle display more? Um. I see. Okay, it's there. Yep. All right. I see it on the screen. Um. So this is very good for melee. These arms. I'm um, keeping the sword, then it might be better to have better specialization in that. Current EM load is slightly worse. Uh, weight is also worse, meaning my speed's probably gone down. Hmm, arm load limit is increased, though. Um, by a slight amount, but my current load in general is fine. Target tracking is one point better. I think these are the upgrade for what I'm going for, so let's go with that. And then I'm broke. Good call out. Uh, let me get them arms equipped. Bop. Um, my missile launchers are fine. The guns are fine mostly right now. Let me go ahead and just get the guns in general painted now. User. Do that color for main. I think I do 17 it was. I'll do... Or no, it was like 13 and 25, I think. What was it? I can check. 27 and 13. Those were the two I went back and forth between. Oh, 
27 and 13, was it? Yeah. Um, I feel like the 13 better for this color. This color can be... I think that looks fine. I'll be the 13, or no, 27. Support. That'll be the purple, I think. Yep. 27. That will be. It could probably stay that color. Yeah, probably stay that color. Make that the 13. Other. Make it that. 13. Advice. I think I make that purple every time. Yo. So, old equipment for full price and buy back. Yeah. Mm hmm. User. Main color that. 20. No, 13. For the main body of the item. User. Probably just going to copy the same side, to be honest. 13. Or no, that's a uh, 27. Uh, 27. Optional. I think that one will stay the black. Now we'll do that purple. 13 fat though. Other. I don't even see it, so I'll just keep it black. Uh, 13. My device is this color. There we go. There we go. Everything's matching up now. Uh, save edits and quit. There we go. Were there more parts in the shop that I missed? There's all that. Yep. 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 Oh. Those are some fucked up looking legs. Yeah. I need to buy this generator, I think, soon. Or no, I don't. That's bad. That's for lighter weight stuff. Because the incapacity is fucking garbage. Hard is fast. Like, extremely fast. Although, that might be bad for my current stuff, at least. But we'll find out. We'll test stuff later. So, already. Ooh, new training. I can get new stuff. For free. We love free stuff. Of course, it's boring to watch, but hey. All right, not apathy. Double trigger. Boost and maneuverability. Yeah, I know about the quick boost. Generators and basic specs. Hold the sun. Yeah, quick boost. Generators install. Yeah, Oakland Treasure Assembly. Do do do. Change quick generators. AC the quick generator. Our control system is solid on the AC. Affects targets tracking to close, medium, and long range, and missile lock on middle lock time. This AC is equipped with the FCS that is specialized for close range combat, allowing it to reliably land attacks with its higher firepower 
weapons. So basically, just fucking shotgun rockets. equipped with four range weapons special yeah okay all right hold on why does it tell me to salt boost yeah yeah Death by extreme amount of bullets. Is it gonna give me the rocket or the guns I was using there? That's the question. It's gonna give me the boosters, okay. Interesting. I'll take a look at this. Oh, and uh okay. Who and a generator? That's nice of them. Let me see the other training. Very lucrative. Oh, they give me some big ass fucking guns. Reverse, reverse joint parts. Uh, wrist joint, leg units excel in jumping and can also leverage their length strength to improve quick boosts. These leg units are also capable of high jumps that do not consume EN, making it easier to achieve aerial retreats and shift to aerial combat. Okay, that is... Okay, it's the did, uh, digigrade legs, essentially. Oh, that's why I need to use it. Okay. Grenade cannon. Let's see if I'm supposed to run that cause of the area damage on pound pack. When using weapons in this nature, you can exploit area damage to create effects by firing on ground at form uh, aerial position. Okay. Weapon types. Weapons fall into one of the three categories depending on the type of damage they inflict. Kinetic, explosive, energy. Yeah, okay. The defensive performance of ACs and other crafts vary for each of these damage types, determining uh, their susceptibility or resistances. Up to me to find out which is which. I'm guessing you are energy. Yep. You are kinetic. Or you're all just so small it doesn't matter. Oh, energy hit you a lot harder, I think. Energy weapons and overheating. Uh, heat when fired, and this ultimately results in overheating. Uh, when overheated, the weapons can be temporarily disabled, or will be temporarily disabled, uh, but functionality will be regained once the weapon is allowed to cool. Avoid overheating by monitoring the rate of fire. Uh, hold, yeah, okay. Bop. Ricochets. Ricochet will occur when enemies have high defense, significantly reduced the damage they take. To counteract that, try attacking at a close range or switch to explosive weapons. Okay.
Give me that fucking grenade cannon. I want that grenade cannon. That grenade cannon's kicked ass. Laser handgun. Okay, that's fine. Uh, park shop. Buy shop. I'm gonna do that. That was the laser gun that I just got. Okay. Anything else? I think it should probably just that gun, to be honest. So, alright, these flip joints. So this would be good for jumping. Because they're like anthro, or not anthro, um, pitchy grade. Whatever they're called. I think. Reverse joint. Okay, now we're on. This is still technically bipedal, so this one's in particularly good for jumping. Even though it has that kind of leg structure. Good to keep in mind. Um, we go check that generator and stuff and see if I can make use of any of that. Um, first of all, I got boosters. These ones. That's a lot more thrust. Not no uh, not a whole lot of upwards though. So it'll be a lot of ground combat. Uh, close battle. The close battles thrust. If I want reverse legs, wait till chapter three. Okay, you got it. Um, no upward thrust, really. I already have rough upward stuff for these guys, I think. These guys are just terrible. <laughs> Fuck. Hey, it's quick boost, but it's not very good for getting height. Um, it will definitely push my speed better, though. The end load is rough. It's getting, like, dangerously close to being over. Uh, what about these, this chip? Close range combat. Okay, so you said, um, close range combat is pretty much where it's at. Medium to close range. Long range is kind of, eh. At least until later. Or something like that. Um, so that's not bad. This is more Dominantly mid-range uh, assist, though. You know, that guy just sucks. Uh, generator. The end capacity is higher. Recharge rate is higher. Supply recovery. What's what's supply recovery? Yeah, mid range close range is best. Okay. Uh, F. recovery. It's the only thing that's worse. Everything else is pretty much better than the base. So, I mean, whatever it is, how fast your supply of energy recovers. Okay. Without using energy weapons, though, that's not too bad. It's going to be mostly my boosters are going to have a rough time with that. I imagine. It's only slightly worse. Everything else is better, and it allows me to do more things with my build. Fire, energy firearm specialization is a lot higher, though, too. But then again, it is made by the Arquivus group or corp, whatever. I'm going to check that other generator real quick. Um, part shop. This one. This one... Has a little bit less capacity. Okay, I don't want that. <laughs> I need more capacity. Not energy farm specialization, because I don't think I'm really going to use the firearms but, uh, energy weapons that much. You can put on better boosters and legs if you want, if you're worried about weight. Yeah, I figured the generator is the building block. I need one that's not going to focus on energy weapons, though, because I'm not really looking to use energy weapons, I don't think. Although it probably wouldn't be bad to have at least one on my build. Um, which honestly could just be a laser cannon because I'm only going to really need it for Anki some bitches. But then I'm going to need that better energy load, which the generator will help. Let's see if I can do that if I have that generator on. Bop. 
Art shop by... Well, I know that. I'm saying that generator I was looking at, or, or the one I got from that. Um, oop, where you go? This one. That I'm now able to equip this if I got enough money. Um, sorry, I got lost. Uh, uh, this guy. This guy has high energy firearm specialization. That was the only thing I was worried about with this generator because I'm not planning on using a whole lot of energy weapons. But it should be fine, because it's not like a maxed out bar. It's just good. It's just good with it. Everything else is better, except for this player recovery, as I said before. Um, so yeah. There's also other things I got. I need someone to look at, which is this pistol. Pistol is okay. Yeah, I know. That's that's what I was worried about because I I'm not, I'm only worried about it because I'm not using it. That's the thing. Handgun. But the charge shot is so much better on that. Um. Pulse blade, right? Yep. Um. Pulse shield, don't care. Well, that's fine. This will give me more speed on the ground, like I said. Upward, even just going up consumes more that way, too. I imagine this is good for, like, AC on AC combat. Airborne, uh, I think that's what it stands for. Melee attack thrust. We'll clip it, try it out, why not? We'll see how much I hate it or not. Sorty. Missions. Oh, Operation Wall Climber. Well. Extra water based on the number. That means I have to try it. Okay. I'm going to die like a dog out there. Just the way it be, man. Your objective is to take the Liberation Front Fortress, the Wall. Show them you're worth the credits. Six to one. Trying to put Tered uh, players be crying at this point in the game. Still don't have chink treads. So sad. Main system activating combat mode. Commence mission. We'll start by clearing Ooh, the way loot. for Archivist. Take out the Gatling cannons protecting the city and the Bows Tetrapod MT further in. This heavy fire can make from up top. Ow. Stop focusing on me, you jackass.
I found. Oh my god. <laughs> Lasers. I want to find more enemies. Ow. Ow. I'm gonna get my shit wiped by this guy. Gotcha. No matter of pairs, but I got gotcha. you. Just gonna take out these guys one at a time. Oop. More salmon, but it will. Free money. Da da da. Free money. Da 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 da. Free money, da da da. Free money. Give me that moolah. This wall kind of sucks. Anyone low? Nope. Anybody? I got some high though. Bye. Yo. Yeah. I'm not gonna use the boost thing. We're not supposed to be right here. Come on. Hello. Confirmed. You're inside the wall. Be prepared for close quarters combat. Okay. Not quite good at tracking that. There should be a lift nearby. The target is close. 
I'm gonna die to the target. Because I'm out of repairs. Fucked up too many times with that big boy. Oh, thank lord. <clears throat> Never mind, I might not die. There's a chance. <laughs> I think it's my first boss. You're rusty, aren't you? You must be Raven. Nah. One of the infamous handler Walter's hounds. Maybe. Dude, just because your name is Rusty doesn't mean you don't need to, you know, use some anti-rust on your AC there. Ooh. Wrong button. But not having vertical movement is really sucking. You're being a jack off. Fucking jackass. Start checkpoint. Can't do the charge shot. I don't think whenever he's gone.
Mines? Oh, you got mines, okay. I don't, you just started having mines suddenly, I don't know. Some good money. Give me it all cash. One new message. Who is We're it? War buddies oh, now. I think I should tell you something. During Operation Wall Climber, Archibus was planning to sacrifice you. The plan was to use independent mercenaries to clear okay. the way so that the Vespers could step in and take over. I do recall. But instead, you took the wall. The higher-ups are going to remember you now, that's for sure. As will I. You exercise and training. All right. You add them to booches. All right. I mean, I'm in chapter three now. Is that how that works? Anyways. Uh, tetrapod, then the quad legs. And the tech legs. Okay, we're going back to back. The biggest boy builds. It is. Tetrapod parts. Uh, tetrapod leg units have high load capacity and enable AC builds equipped with heavy, multiple heavy weapons. Tetra Prod ACs can switch to hover mode after sending off the ground, allowing them to remain suspended in air for some time. Uh, press uh, space and air, hover mode on and off. Uh, blah, 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 quick boost, yeah, why would? Wow. Bazooka. Recoil, um, charge attacks, and fire from heavy weapons such as grenade launchers cause more recoil than other attacks, forcing the AC to assume a firing stance. Tetrapods uh, are capable of absorbing this kind of reload, allowing these attacks to execute uh, during movement. Yup. Boom. Hover mode allows you to yep. Hey, yep, that makes sense.
pretty slow. The hover mode's kind of nice, but past that, I don't know. Ooh, that's the grenade launcher, isn't it? The the nice one. Or is that the... That was not the grenade launcher, was it? That was the weapon I was just using there. Not the back one. By this guy. Or not. Ooh, is it back? No, it's not back. Oh, it's on my other arm. Ooh! Ooh, baby! But I got a lot of sword stuff on still right now, so I don't want to really worry about that. Sword has been coming in clutch for me. Pretty much. I'm sp why didn't they give me the, the legs for that? The tutorial is about the legs. Why did they give me the gun? I don't know. Whatever. Mm, tank ACs. Bah. You know what? Give me a moment. I need to make a be right back screen real quick. And we back. Okay. Get that audio back in here. Oh wait, I need. Wait, did I not take this either? I need to update my Streamlabs. I think because I didn't update my feed either. Huh. I'll have to do that after stream. Oh well. Stream today connected. That's all I can really care about. Don't really, 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 really care about anyways. Alright, uh, tank ACs. Training stuff. Woohoo! Wow, they immediately show Karis, uh, wheelchair man. <clears throat> um. Alright, so tank leg units are heavily armored and boast excellent loading capacity. In addition to lending themselves to highly durable builds, they are also good candidates for high firepower assemblies. Tank ACs, or tank type ACs, are capable of absorbing recoil, which allows them to fire heavy weapons without entering a firing stance. How can you enter a firing stance with a fucking tank treads, anyways? Drifting. Uh, okay, to execute drift move in a direction you want to uh, want to face immediately after a quick boost. One down. Throw them apart. They don't. Next. Oh, okay. These, what are these? Vertical missile launcher. Uh, yep. Okay. Another training is available already after that. Alright. Just checking if you were actually doing them, I guess. Give me... Oh, well. I guess I can take a look at that rocket launcher. Um, this one's kind of garbage normally. 
And this one, let me see the video on that. Boom. I am a fan of that. Or at least I'm not making use of the other one very well. Should would be more accurate. Um, okay. Alright. Let's see here. I got a good bit of cash, man. Let's do the rest of the trainings, as I'm sure they can also give me other options. Uh, advanced Mercenary Certification. What is it, like, putting everything together? Oh, I have my AC for this. Okay. Uh, adaptive assemblies. During real missions, you can expect enemy reinforcements and other changes to the situation. The test of advanced mercenaries is in their ability to adjust to a wide range of combat scenarios and adapt their AC assembly to meet the needs of the mission. Right, I don't have that gun. You're done. Ooh, you're a fast bitch, aren't you? Stop trying to break my stagger, you bastard. Took some damage, but they have a hand of both types. Ready complete. It's a decent training for testing on um, ACs. need to do training anymore I guess it means no no free shit anymore sad sad day for me that's the grenade launcher yep Ooh, what the hell are you I don't ever see you at all bubble gun <laughs> the only thing I can imagine that's the only thing I can think of it's just bubble gun uh yet another bubble gun Another one of them rocket launchers. What are you? Missile launcher. Uh, 
Oh. Let's see. You're the plasma launcher, how are you? Oh, whoop. Uh, I should probably change out my headwear. It's either this head or this head. That's mass produced. That's medium weight. Bomb. I'll go with this one. Yep. You sure? Ooh, what the f <laughs> It's worse across the board. <laughs> but it looks cool. Um, It is... Close quarters combat, reload, ideal weight. Um, Ian can soon, uh, so it's better, uh, it's kind of, bleh, words. Better at going up with consumption, but not really going up at all. It's slower. It has less consumption on Ian, though. It's, airborne thrust is a lot better. And it's consumption is a lot better. You are mid-range and close-range, but primarily mid-range. You're, you're the lightweight. I don't care about you. That's that's kind of what I'm looking for right now. What are you? Because you're expensive. Ian capacity is a lot. The weight is a lot. But it does not mess up my current load amount at all. Is it slowing me down much? It is slowing me down by like 30 or so. A little bit over 30. Um. Okay. Let me just go ahead and sell the shield because I didn't really use it at all. And I'm not using this anymore either. And then that should give me enough for that generator. The biggest boy. Um, because it doesn't really... It does have more energy firearm specialization. There's a lot of capacity, less recharge rate. And supply recovery is worse. This, on the other hand, boosts all the EN capacity and recharge rate. Supply recovery is better, too. Post recovery, EN supply. I don't know what that is primarily, but I'm sure it's not vital. It might be vital. I don't know. Um. It does slow me down. Not a lot, though. It gives me more options. Slightly more options. The, the the energy discrepancy on these two generators is uh, just fucking insanity. Hmm. Weight is abysmal. For general usage, the VP series of generators can be best, especially VPC. So I don't have the VPC available, but for general use, this thing is fucking fantastic, is what you're saying? God, I can only imagine what the stream delay is. Maybe not D. Is that the, the 20D? But A... Oh, okay, I see what you're saying. A series. Okay, this is a D, so this is not what I'm going to want. So for right now, this might be better than what I currently am using. And cheaper, to be honest. So 
So when I, I find that, but with a, a C or a C to A, A to C, then that'll be what I'm looking for. Got it. Uh, yeah. The weight is worse, but I really like that. All that's better, so whatever. Run with it. All right, now to make use of that um, tidbit of stuff I got, let's go ahead and get my back stuff, like, just great, maybe. I don't know. This is my actual gun hand. Um, shotgun is close range combat. Bazooka's fucking gnarly. All, all, all these big ones I would want to replace with my sword, I think, but I don't, I'm not going to do that. The laser rifle, if I had the other generator, I would probably be better. Same for that. And that's also plausible again. So I think for my main weapon right now, that uh, line rifle I have is pretty good. Placing my sword. It's a laser blade. It's a new blade. Um, that's better than... For like a single slash, my it's better for charge slashes. Okay, um, it's not double damage though. It's not like double the current ones. So I don't know if that's actually better. The impact hit is a lot, but like if I actually get the double hits in a lot, I'm not gonna want to use this. And I'm pretty decent at getting double hits, so probably not gonna use that. Yeah, yeah, okay. Um, laser cannon is nuts. If I mean, just look at that. Like, again. Boom. Yeah, pretty good. But it's not going to let me... It's not going to hit very often if I'm using it to try to get ACs to dodge. This one, on the other hand, will track them down. If I use this one on this slot, what? Oh, another buckler, huh? Or that's a buckler. This one was a shield. What's the buckler? Oh, it's like purely parry. Okay. Got it. Um, let's put this guy on that spot. And then buy this guy for this spot. And then let's go ahead and assemble this sucker. I got a new head. Let's put that on first. Boom, pow. Um, back unit. Put on the laser gun. This unit. Put that guy. Um, and then I just need to remember which one's which. Main gun's fine. Sword's good. I am still barely good on the EN load. Current load on well, actually everything is fine. Which means my speed should be okay. Boosters could be better, but hey, whatever. Um, I think I'm looking solid right now. The only thing I could probably be better is the core itself at some point. Which, for chest uh, pieces, actual cores. You said the orbiter is pretty good. I think my upgrade would end up being... Or, yeah, you can sure fall. Because I don't really need more equip load. Current load. Is the core really what's determining the end load? I didn't realize that. Hmm. So that means that my arms could be better then? No, it's not the arms either. Is it the legs? It's probably the legs. Isn't it? Yeah, it's the legs. Okay. Oh, there's a tank and all that. Okay. Spindly. Okay. Um. My better, like, actually. For functionality, I think is one of these two legs. Gives me a lot more, a good, good chunk bit more boost speed, and I'm still not needing more load capacity. 
but the actual armor is worse. So I need to get uh, an upgraded version of one of these kind of legs, I guess. With Alchem later. So I'm, I'm overcompensating with the legs right now. That's fine. I just mean that my speed's going to hurt a little bit. Got a job for you, 621. One of the Balaam companies has put in a request. Church, got 13 Raven. This request comes from our affiliate Dafa. Conducting an investigation into the Vespers, Archibus's augmented human squad. Currently, our focus is on their fourth squad leader, B4 Rusty. Oh. Then. Skip the route Rusty took during Operation Wall Climber and retrieve combat logs from the wrecks he left on his way in. Wall is now under Archibus's control. They stationed their MT squads there for the Coral Survey. As such, he'll be targeting the brief window where their main force is deployed elsewhere. Keep an eye on the time and retrieve as many logs as you can. That concludes the briefing. Okay. We expect prompt results, Gun 13. Okay. Jeez. Uh, yum, man. I think I'm good. Six two one. You should be used to Rubicon by now. Time to take a break from shooting up the place. But I want to keep on shooting up the place. Main system activating combat mode. Commence mission. Search the nearby racks. Oh, oh, it's speed. found in Gallia is going to dry up sooner than later and we just can't harvest as much coral as we used to though what we little we got uh yeah got it and what li little we do get the corpse squeeze out of us they know we need it to raise mealworms how many more children must we watch starve the corals for food some time there's one Open Steel Haze. Video recorder extracted from the wreck allows one to discern the simile of uh, Rusty's AC, Steel Haze. Steel Haze appears to be assembled from the Schneider high, mobile, uh, yeah, high mobility frame equipped with weapons that allow for swift, agile actions. Notably, Rusty appears to be favor kinetic weaponry that Vesper members would not normally use.
friendly comms. Comms recorded extraction from the wreck. This appears to be a conversation between allies prior to the start of the mission. Into the hole. I'm going. I'm going to go into the hole. Well, we can't beat the top vespers. We as good as we are good as dead. At least uh, Z, Z is off duty. She's the Liberation Front's little sister. She doesn't deserve to be out there on the battlefield. She can still love and be loved. Have family or have a family. Are they being sexist? Got it. Okay. Communications attempted. A video record extracted from the wreck contains leftover data from uh, an attempt to communicate with Rusty during combat. How could you? I know who you are. I've seen Uncle's f files. Uh, at least tell me why. I know. God, I'm going to the hole. Hello, hole. All right. <clears throat> System log extracted from the wreck allows one to examine the commands received by craft prior to its destruction. No data regarding offensive or evasive matters detected. It appears that the pilot of this craft immediately pulled the emergency eject lever at the start of the operation. Very for combat. Oh, hey, it's, uh, her. Bitch. I need that last log, damn it. Alright, hold on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Oh, damn it. There, she's dead. I'm gonna, I'm gonna restart mission. I wasted a lot of time early on. I can get a lot more done now that I know where all the logs are. Main system activating combat mode. Oh, going Commission. down. Search the nearby racks for combat logs recording engagements with V4 Rusty. Okay, I got that. I don't think I can actually grab this one. System log extracted from the wreck allows one to examine the operation of an aircraft prior to its destruction. The log indicates that the FCS was operating at maximum capacity, and yet it was still unable to track the enemy. It was completely overwhelmed by Rusty's speed. Uh, this is clearly a one-sided engagement. Going... Alright, uh, the well dry... I did read this, yep, right. Yeah, we can read that one. Going. Whoops, strong button. 
Looking for that. Going. Got that. I don't need to fuck with you guys, to be honest. Um, any ones I missed around here? I don't see any of the wreckage, so let's go down here. Analyzing. Yep, tell that. Worthless log, to be honest. Got it. Rust needs encoded comms. Comms recorded the extract from the wreck. Contains leftover data from an attempt to intercept Rusty encrypted line. When me comes Erlong will technology uh Elcano you must hidden them. I don't know who the fuck that is. Yeah, I don't know where the another log is, man. Uh, I got this desert log, I got that one. I got seven logs, it's a pretty good amount of logs. Whee! Boop. Up top, yeah, I'm going up top. How many logs are there supposed to be? As a whole, did that area, did that area. I could go more that direction. Maybe there's more that way. Not if I'm gonna time to grab it, really. We're helicopters and shit that came. Oh, that's blocked off too. Um, I didn't see over any over here either. See any more? Return to base. If there was another one, oh well. I got as much. I got the ones I knew about. Hey, I don't know what that means, but I did it. Arms. Mind alpha. Goofy looking arms. Two new messages. Go 13 Raven. Bagged us some decent intel on V4. I'll report this to Commander Michigan. Additionally, Introduce myself. Gun six red. But you can call me sir. Privileged to be among Balaam's best. Even if I am stuck whipping you independence into shape. Believe you me, I'm gonna put you to work. Alright then. I don't want that. Intro like. Registration number RB23. Call sign Raven. Your records have been updated. Granting authorization to perform ACOS upgrades. Additional. All Mind hereby invites you to the Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation. Hey, it's the thing you want me to do. The Arena is a virtual combat.
Combat Simulator, designed to support the development of registered mercenaries. It also serves as a benchmark to appraise and rank the mercenaries active on Rubicon. We look forward to your participation. Uh, OS tuning and arena. It's operating tuning, operation system. Uh, okay, expand OST chips in your possession to upgrade your AC's OS from the OST tuning menu. Upgrading the OS unlocks features and improves functionality. OST chips can be attained in the arena. I see. That's, that's what I was looking for, so I don't need this sword anymore per se. I can just do that. Um, of course, I could also do this sword and just make more damage. Having both is good, to be honest. Uh, weapons, weapon bay. Locks the weapon bay feature for AC shoulders, allowing shoulder weapons to be replaced with additional hand weapons. Um, right, that's what you, you also mentioned this. Uh, get pulse armor, I think it is. Pulse armor? Uh, um, unlocks core expansion pulse armor that allows it to be installed. Pulse armor creates a pulse barrier that trails the AC, dramatically increasing defense performance until it exceeds its durability or time limit. Control R while equipped. Activate pulse armor. That does sound useful, yeah. There's also pulse protection. Um, pulse protection creates a pulse barrier in a fixed position, providing cover from enemy fire until the barrier reaches its d uh, durability or time limit. Uh, terminal armor. Uh, terminal armor automatically triggers a pulse barrier when AC's AP reaches its limit, greatly enhancing defensive uh, defense until the barrier reaches its durability or time limit. Uh, kinetic weapon fire control tuning. Optimize fire control of AC and weapon... To enhance... Okay, so I'm going to really want to, like, get a lot of chips. <laughs> Fighting virtual battles against copies of AC is created using all mine mercenary crafted at a, for arena menu. When an arena battles to obtain OST chips, uh, opponent AC data, and opponent emblems, you can use OST chips to perform OS upgrades. Uh, let's just kill them all. Yeah, I see that, yeah. Okay. I'm not optimally building for anything. I'll just play better. Welcome to the Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program. First subject is the guy has a chainsaw? Also, he's got a fucking... His foot? Is that his foot for his emblem? Commencing evaluation. Fucking gross. Dude sucked. Target destroyed. Concluding evaluation. It's exactly that double hit that I didn't grab the other sword because it, it does so much fucking stagger damage and damage in general. Other sword hits hard once. That's about it. Thirty-one seconds. Chips. I'm gonna grab that kick immediately though, because just having that as a backup in case my sword's on cooldown is nice. Um, yeah, because it, uh, boost kick hits it with a heavy impact by combining the speed of an assault boost with sheer weight of the AC, and I'm grabbing some heavy components, so, but I'm not going into fucking, I'm a giant fucking tank yet. Um, past that, I don't really need quick turning, snap turns to side and rear directions, I'll, I'll just forget I have that, to be honest. 
Plus, I can shake my mouse pretty damn quick. Um, assault armor. Uh, there's nothing else I can really buy except a quick turn. Of course, I could just save up and get it the three item. Okay. Arena! Arena, there we go. Also, it says I have something in uh, here. I don't recall getting anything. Oh, right, the arms. I forgot about that. Um, makes me a bit heavier, which will be nice for the kick. Uh, let me see. The, the melee, spe melee specialization is fucking garbage. Let's not do that. I can redo arena stuff to get cash, too. Okay, not bad. Uh, burn pickaxe. Okay. Did I have to quick that kick thing, or is that just automatically on now? Oh, how do I do the kick? I thought I did it. I think I do have to put it. Shit. Big rockets, okay. It's good. I'm having a hard time finding the timing on getting to activate. Cause somebody to dash away though. More chips. I don't care. I don't care about the emblems. It's a nice feature, I guess, but I don't. I don't see anybody really using it. Right, uh, is that this? No, it's not. How do I use the kick? I thought I did it. Oh, I have to do it again during Assault Boost. Okay, that makes sense. Oops. Should have read that. Was it the Pulse Armor Omega? Or were you talking about something else, potentially? Pulse armor or weapon bay if you want to swap weapons. Um, well, my buddy told me to get pulse armor, so I guess I'll grab it. I'll just have to get used to using it. I'm guessing you turn that on whenever you get staggered, probably. Oh, whoops. Oh well. I'll just beat this guy without it. Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program, number 27, rank F. Final evaluation. Subject AC. 
Hey. Sorry, I wasn't expecting that. I didn't even read the guy's name. Pistol and a bazooka, huh? Go hoo! Oh, that bazooka is nailing me every time. Ah, oh, shit. Maybe a better dodge than the bazooka. Or the grenade launcher. Either way, it hit me. It ain't good. Oh, shit. God, he hits me every time I get off a fence with that. Gotcha. Target destroyed. This concludes F rank evaluation. Well done. Mine, probably. Congratulations, you have surpassed rank F. We are glad to oversee your development as a mercenary. All mind exists for all mercenaries. Okay. Give me more of that tuning. All right, weapons bay. Um, can I like, can I like to equip the um weapons bay so I take over the pulse armor slot? Is that is that what that is? Because so I'm not going to bother with it. I'm fine with just having what I got and running with it. Is there forever? Okay, so it doesn't take the slot. Um, not sorting. It was teeny tuning. Seems like a pretty vital thing to have. Besides weight control. Um, which I don't have enough chips for. Uh, mainly purge weapons. Actually, I probably wouldn't really need that. If I'm building right, then I shouldn't really need that at all. But, seems like it's vital, so I'll grab it. Um, with that in mind, however... 
So, okay. Let me read that again so I can actually understand what the hell this did. Ah. Allows shoulder weapons to be replaced with additional hand weapons. Oh, so I can equip my hand weapons on my shoulders. Instead of having the rockets and stuff. Okay. Interesting. Um... This one, not that one. This one's been not doing me so hot. So I'll probably go back to this, to be honest. Turn on my style, right. So far I've been getting comfortable with using rocket launchers to bait out a dodge so then I can use my primary gun to nail a shot. Um... What I'm not getting so good at is using this gun to also land that shot as needed. So perhaps I can use that feature for the this weapon. I'm thinking, maybe? How do I um how do I toggle that? Or would it have to be both? Or do I have to buy it from the back, maybe? Um, on the shoulder, you have a second tab for your hand weapons. Oh, I see. Okay. Thank you. Linear rifle. That's what I have equipped right now. Yeah. Okay. So that is um, a kinetic weapon, I believe. So if I put an energy weapon there, that will give me that option. Or, better yet, I could put a fucking big gun on it. Use the big gun and swap back to my rifle. This does stagger damage. This does... Uh, well, I need to think better. Laser handgun. Uh, toggle display. Attack power is less. Turn hit. Tool room with coin. Yeah. Hmm. I believe the pistols with our call is good for staggering. It's the impact value, that's right. Okay. Damage on this. Charge power. Charge impact is what really hits you. As for the damage of it, it's not too that high. So I need a high damage weapon to switch to whenever I get that impact close to finishing, I think. So, let's see here. Hi, Volk. I'm, I'm trying to big brain... Um, right, I also need to buy it for the right, right arm. I do like me some grenade launchers. Brig braining is hard, yeah. That's my EN shortfall. It will be an issue if I do that. 
Let's give that a shot with the grenade launcher, I think. Would probably be a decent idea. AC, then go ahead and assembly. Go ahead and do... Not arms. Um, that one. Switch to that side. Give me that guy. I have one less... If I press that button now, I'll switch. The gun I currently have on is really good for getting stagger. Assuming it can land hits. I can tap it, and it does a good amount of stagger damage by itself. And then also, if I can bait out dodges, I can get a nice big hit with the charge shot. Um, the only problem is getting baiting out the charge shot. Uh... Which right now, I only have the rocket launcher I have on my back. This guy. Uh, which is decent on doing that. Or call. Let me just double check. This is the downward one. Yeah. So that will cause them to dodge. And I need to find this good timing in between that dodge to release the shot so I can nail him. Uh, let's go back to the arena. And never mind, I don't have more to do. Well, I could just redo this guy and just test it on this guy. Since it gave me a problem before. Once I get him close to staggering, that's when I switch to the grenade launcher and really hit him. We're all I got. Did I buy it on the wrong hand? Oh no, that's that guy. Never mind. I'm gonna load myself. Two guns for stagger build up. One melee and one rocket. Not sure. Right. Uh, I was thinking about trying to use the grenade launcher after the melee though. Um, but we'll, I'll, I'll learn eventually. I also have the anti staggers thing. God damn it. I gotta try to use my charge shot after he uses his rocket. I'm not using my rockets either. I gotta pay them attention. God damn. You're right, I'm not really using my rockets enough, and I'm also not using my shield, my sword, getting good hits. I'm just about to lose, yep. Hmm. Not really succeeding in baiting out any hits with that rocket launcher. Hmm. Let me go ahead and quit program. Two guns. Yeah, I was thinking... Since I'm not able to get the charge shot off very much due to not having two rockets anymore, I was thinking maybe either going with the pistol or, yeah, I could go at the submachine gun. Because this still has a lot of impact, which is good. And switch the rocket for big damage. I have the kick. Hmm. I can do an assault boost, sword attack for major uh, stagger damage. Because I'm pretty good at that. So I won't really need an impact weapon if I'm doing that consistently and well. Meaning, yeah, I probably would want to go with an assault rifle or machine gun. Uh, 
because I can get the sword assault boost off. Then currently I have the bazooka on that weapon. No, but um, that would be funny. But sometimes to keep Shredder Roar up is helpful. Well, the machine gun would still, if I'm like landing hits, it would maintain the stagger bar, I'm thinking. Or is it too little impact to, main, to actually do that? Okay, yeah. Um, so I'm going to want to make sure my gun is reloaded before I go in for a sword attack so I can, if I'm ready to do that, manually reload the uh, machine gun. Uh, after the sword attack, if they bust through, I need to quickly switch to my other gun and fire the rocket or do a kick. Probably gonna want to do a kick. Because kicks more or faster. Then they'll still be in stagger for a little bit and I can try to get a rocket off. It's just what I'm switching with the sword. If I'm if I'm switching the sword, of course having the rockets is still nice. Um, this one does bait out dodges more frequently. Once they go for a dodge, then I can go for the assault boosted sword attack. That gets a lot of stagger damage, and I'll hit him with the machine gun. Once the machine gun's done, I pull out the other gun, the uh, bazooka. So. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Let's give it a shot. Also, um, let me. This is on. What was the command to put that on? Like, to actually use that? I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to use that whenever I get staggered, which I do get staggered a lot. Um, control R. Okay. I'll have to keep that in mind. Oh, hi, man. Now I get less opportunities of being struck down by the dude. Damn it. Uh, okay. I'll have to make sure I have the all ready to go. Ah, oh, great. Okay. I have to get better at. Crap. AP at fifty percent. Okay, the switch off is pretty quick with that. My timing is off. <clears throat> Damn it. Oh, all right. to improve. Hmm. 
He's very fast. This is not helping against making him dodge. And this one is long to actually impact. You don't usually dodge it though either. You're usually too fast for it. Yeah, I've been using the auto lock. As long as you mean something else. It just keeps on losing the uh, the auto lock as they go over my head, which these boosters I have are very much ground boosters. Because another grenade launcher is pretty fast, though. I could kick the sword for a pistol, but the sword's pretty versatile. I do have the kick now. I want to give another shot with this build. I'd have to, let's say, get rid of the missile for the sword. Well, I already have the sword. Uh, the, the missile switching with my uh, machine gun, the submachine gun. Okay, so you, you are... Well, here's what I was suggesting. I, I kick this, because it's just not helping any, for a pistol on this hand. So then I can build up a lot of stagger damage, and then whenever the stagger has been hit, like they finally get staggered, I switch to the sword real quick and slash them twice, get a heavy damage in, and then finish off with the other bazooka, or the grenade launcher. Um, but I'll have to go buy one. Unless I can't have two different weapons. I have to have it both to do double trigger, both the same. If it's both the same, then that's fine. So I was thinking this hand, I was going to buy the pistol. And then I'll have the submachine gun and the pistol. Submachine guns maintaining the uh, stagger while every pistol hit is building it up. Once I get close to finishing off the stagger bar um actually i would go back and forth i mean to make the most use out of it so i would uh, hit with the pistol as the pistol reloading switch to the submachine gun main turns uh the stagger damage um once stagger damage is done i switch both weapons uh to sword and bazooka Get the double hit in with the sword. Maybe try to get the kick in afterwards. And then bazooka. At least that's what I'm thinking. Will that work or no? Well, um, yeah, you're right. Um, can I afford both? I can afford both. I'll buy both. I'll try it both ways. Um, I'm going to start with um, the pistol, though, as my other hand right now. Um, and actually I want to, I'll probably actually want to swap that actually. Arm unit, make that the pistol, put this one on the sword. Yeah, I know. Um, I'm more used to using my left mouse button for semi-automatic anyways, so it kind of works out. Meanwhile, right, I just hold down consistently.
I, I click my mouse button a lot. Even uh, even in an FPS uh, FPS shooters, usually I will not spray and pray my weapons. I usually do a burst. Too much playing games like Valorant or uh, Counter Strike kind of put it in me to do that. Also, less bullets being wasted. Guns. Oh, fuck you. Wasn't quick enough. I'll oh, fuck you. God, he just hits me every time with that. Where'd he go? Oh, I hate that. Oh, you suck. Damn it. I got it off one time there. Oh. Problem with the submachine gun is I don't realize if it's firing or not. Because it's not making a loud enough sound. Main system. Activating combat. Like I hear my pistol firing, but I barely hear the submachine gun. It might be because I don't have one by your muscle on. Where the fuck did he go? God damn it. Oh, I have to time that better. You stop being above me. I... Got him. I figured it out. <laughs> Very aggressive build. <laughs> That's what I've just made. Maybe I want to prepare more for close range then. Oy. All right. Thanks for the help, Jack. Um, I think I like where I'm at. Um, the only thing I would probably want to do is I 
probably see about getting a new chess piece if there's any good ones. I don't know. Nope, they still haven't got me any new selections here. Um, it was actually the arms I needed to get new ones of. Or legs. Those legs are not bad. Oh. I need something like this, but better. I think it was, anyways. Give me a bit more speed. Right now, I got good better armor, though. Alright. Um, let's go back to the sorry. I don't know what this is, but okay. Yeah, you're right. I should probably do that at some point. But currently, the only uh, AC pieces I have available right now, right now I don't really want to use. Sides of the coin. Anyways, um, I'm like really lightly equipped except for that bazooka. But anyways, some advice before you go, six two one. Expect the unexpected. I'm expecting to shoot things is what I'm expecting. Main system activating combat mode. Commence mission. Investigate Bouse Arsenal number two. I've been checking the perimeter and I'm picking up nothing. What happened here? It's too quiet. Thanks for the death flag. Than I thought it would have. DD. Coded comms. Was that mech behind what happened here? 621. Continue the investigation. There we go. Okay. Scanner. 
Haven't even taken a hit yet. Listen, I don't think I have. Oh, no, nah, well, spoke too soon. Right, I ain't dealing with you yet. Where the fuck did you go? Fucker, you are. Yep. What happens? I want. I need to switch. Yep, that one and this one. Back to main weapons, I think. Yeah, okay, good. Uh, where are we at? Where are we at? Where are we at? One. Now there's more. There you are. A little bit of damage, but it's alright. Most of it was in that first hit, anyways. Come on. Come on. There we go. Looks like a fucking boss room. It contains faint traces of coral. Must have been an underground vein. Bowser was hiding a well all this time. Six two one above you. Prioritize others, okay. Where are they? <laughs> I need to get up top. Yeah, I prefer if I wasn't.
Oh, hey, chill out, pal. Come on, where the fuck are you? Or it's not you, is it? Oh, no. Oh. I think it is just you, okay. Invisible targets. <coughs> no bonus pay. What the fuck? Long time no see, Walter. Looking good for a change. I see you've got a new augmented human. What happened to 617 and the rest? Their jobs. They did what it took to get us here. Huh. So how's the newcomer doing? Adequately. But Gen 4 augmentation can be unstable. We need to choose our battles. How's things on your end? I found the data our friends left behind. There's something promising in the watch point. I don't know what the fuck any of that means. All I can tell you is I'm going to probably wrap it up here for the night after this no message. Okay, um, yeah, I'm gonna wrap it up here then. Uh, thank you, everyone that checked in and watched tonight. Um, I'll probably get the VOD up of this stream on my channel in a bit. Uh, ooh, that's a lot of messages in that DM, so Lee. Uh, past that, uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and link my Discord in chat. No, I inspect elements, god damn it. Thank you, Jack, for all the help you've given me tonight with uh, strategizing. I think I've gotten a good strat uh, build now for just about any situation. Minus any energy weapons, but I can probably figure that out at some point. Um, past that, all of you have a good night. See you.